Hey guys, how's it going? Tess back again with another squad builder, and this time it's going to be the most expensive team I have ever built. It's only 650,000 coins, but of course, uh, I don't have a coin sponsor like many people on YouTube, so I've had to grind to get the coins I do have. Still quite an expensive squad though, so we're going to jump in. Hopefully this is going up on my own channel as well as the community channel, so if it is going up on the community channel, please, of course, feel free to check the link in the description to my own channel, but let's crack on, shall we? And in goal, we're going to have Man of the Match Courtois, and I ran out of Ran out of coins, couldn't afford the, uh, the uh, team of the season one, but the man of the match one is absolutely superb. I've played two or three games with uh, this particular squad against friends, and I'll play some more online to get some clips for the end for you, but uh, jumping straight in, and this guy is absolutely superb. Play 33,000 coins. He plays better than the team of the season, Arta Moraes, that I paid 100k for. Seriously, a just so overpowered so so overpowered but uh, moving into the defensive line then at right back we're going to have Danny Elvis 90 pace 79 defending 81 passing as well as pretty much all round stats for any position to be completely honest his shot is decent his heading is decent his dribbling is decent he does of course as uh, as true to life pushes on a lot and will overlap a lot of the uh, a lot of the time pushing up down that right hand side a little bit wayward when it comes to positional sense but it's Danny Alves so you kind of you know that going in but uh, very very good right back so far team of the season Felipe Luis is going to be the left back I was actually fortunate enough to pull him in a pack but um, of course a typical Chess I wasn't recording at the time so I missed it but uh, unfortunately for me that was the case but anyway 86 pace 87 defending 85 passing and 84 dribbling are his standout stats again similar to Danny Alves does love to push forward and uh, overlap on the winger but an extremely good player offensively and defensively standing tackle is superb actually really good free kick stats as well which is uh, surprising I didn't know he could take a free kick but uh, anyway moving into the middle we are going to have team of the season PK amazing amazing defender 66 pace 91 defending 86 heading again with the Barca style of play 80 passing 70 dribbling very very much suits my style of play which is kind of Barca-esque possession style football 140,000 coins paid and as you would expect just an absolute bargain for that price really really good play it's his pace that means his pay pace means his pace his pace that means his price is a little bit lower but uh, nonetheless really really good defender as is team of the season Varane who's going to slot in at right centre back only 40,000 coins paid mainly because of his pro uh, his pace but still an extremely good defender that uh, the defensive stats of 85 and heading stats of 84 he's really really tall and physical well as, as at 6 foot 3 so uh, I highly recommend you pick him up He's an absolute bargain player. For 40 grand, you really can't get many better centre-backs. And then into the uh, the midfield line, we're going to have in form Shamal. Really, really good player. Five-star weak foot, four-star skill moves, amazing set pieces on corners and free kicks. And only 18,500 coins paid. One of the best right mids in La Liga. And then actually we'll go across the ring rather than into the middle just yet. And we're going to have the recent man of the match, Isco. I really, really love playing with this guy. His dribbling is superb. He's at 90. 80 pace, 84 shot and 83 passing. Really, really good on the ball. Again, really, really good free kick stats as well. Plenty of choice in this team when it comes to uh, taking corners and free kicks. Paid 95,000 coins. He's probably dropped in price a little bit um, by this point, by the time you see this. But uh, his weak foot is three star. His skill moves are three star. It would really be nice if he he had four star uh, skill moves being a winger but uh, unfortunately he doesn't but the uh, the dribbling just means he can just dribble around players using the skill dribbling rather than trying to uh, to skill his way around them so really really recommend that you pick him up an extremely good player and then uh, sat in front of PK his fellow Barcelona and Spanish teammate Sergio Busquets team of the season of course 62 pace 66 shot 81 dribbling 89 defending 84 passing and 79 heading as with all of this guy's cards this year the uh, the normal the inform the second inform and the uh, the team of the season only 67,000 coins paid again probably because of pace but he is an absolute rock in a central defensive midfield spot obviously only playing two centre mids and they are both in a centre mid not CDM but he does because of his work rates like to come inside and just sit and hold in front of the back line which is superb and uh, really really uh, compliments Benyat alongside him we do of course have team of the season Benyat 72 pace 83 shot 90 passing 82 dribbling all round as well with that 75 defensive rating does have quite good interceptions can nick in and uh, get the ball away from opposition when they're trying to play passes around you in the middle paid 61,000 coins for him again as with pretty much every single player in this team worth every last penny he's got shot power 99 curve of 99 free kick accuracy of 99 long shots of 99 he's just 
His shot is brutal, beyond brutal, and his passing is really, really good as well. And um, he's very, very good at playmaking. Sat in there in front of Brisquets, who holds Benyet, will push forward a little bit and uh, try and link up with the players he's got in front of him, which uh, we're going to start off with second in form Higuain. 80 pace, 86 shots, 79 passing, 85 dribbling, and 77 heading. Four star weak foot, four star skill moves. I paid 84,000 coins for him, which is a little bit on the expensive side because he doesn't have much pace. But I played him at centre forward rather than up top because uh, he can pick the ball up about 30. 30, 35 yards out from goal, couple of spaces, a couple of paces forward, and just smash it. He'll score from anywhere, and he scores finesse shots, lace shots, real rockets, dinks, really nicely placed around the goalkeeper or around a defender into the top corner shots. He will score anything. Really, really enjoy playing with Gonzalo Higuain so far, and hopefully he can score quite a few goals for us for the clips at the end. And then up top, uh, again, I couldn't afford the team of the season, but uh, we do have uh, the upgraded Radamel Falcao. 79 pace, 85 shot, 80 dribbling, and 91 heading. Really, really good heading. Uh, only 15,000 coins paid as well for a player with those sort of stats is really, really good. 5-star weak foot, 4-star skill moves. The heading doesn't come into play too much because he is 5 foot 9. It's more a case of if he has a free header, he will bury it. But if he's jumping up against, say, uh, a PK or a Puyol or someone like that, someone that's quite tall and physical, he's not the best in the air. But if he gets just that extra yard, he will nip in and make sure that that header goes into the back of the net and can score on either foot and uh, either style of goal as well, finesses or lace shots. Really, really good striker all round. The team does lack a little bit of pace, but because the dribbling is so good with uh, the central players and the uh, the players out wide with Shamal and Isco, then uh, it really doesn't come into play too much. You really don't notice it. And of course, with the wing backs pushing on so much because they are so offensive minded, it really, you know, you've got, you get the pace out wide as and when you need it because they are always there, forward and backwards. So uh, that is going to wrap the squad builder part of this video up, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Please do, of course, leave the video a like, and uh, as always, there will be links in the description to my own channel. If you wish to come across and subscribe there, recently uh, recently gone through 1,600 subscribers, which is absolutely superb, so I can't thank you enough for that. If you are watching this and you are subscribed, then, of course, thank you for your continued support. And I'm going to leave you with some clips at the end now with some music over the top. So, again, thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you next time. Thank you.